Let's look at an entitlements and service level agreements in Dynamic CRM. So in the settings service management area, there are a number of places I can go. Service level agreements, entitlements, and entitlement templates. Let's start with entitlement templates. So I've created a simple entitlement template here called the bronze entitlement for heavy equipment. And you can see with a template, I have a number of things I can set. Now an entitlement is an amount of service that a customer is entitled to. They might purchase an entitlement as part of an agreement. It might come with a product as a value added offering when you sell something. So you can see in this case, this entitlement is the bronze entitlement for any heavy equipment that we sell. And it's a basic level of support. It's free for all heavy equipment for one year after purchase. There's a few other things you can see about this that I've set in terms of how do I allocate the labor I give for this entitlement? And that labor can be allocated by the number of cases, the number of issues that you might manage for somebody, or the total number of hours you track managing issues. The other area I have control is, are these gonna be checked off? Is this entitlement going to be consumed whenever I create a case or whenever I resolve a case. So you might say, we will resolve to your satisfaction a certain number of cases in this period, or we will create a certain number of cases whether you're satisfied with the result or not. So you can see I made some selections there. And not required, but I can even have control over how are they able to use this entitlement. In this case, I said email and phone, but I could use any channel that I communicate with somebody on, even Twitter and social channels. And I can decide what products this entitlement applies to. So in this case, a company might have purchased a lot of things from me, but this entitlement is only for their heavy equipment. So if they purchased parts for that heavy equipment, for example, I may not give them the same entitlement for those particular things. And all of these rules can be enforced when I create a case to make sure that the entitlement applies to the case. Now, one other thing I wanna note before we leave this is this entitlement is also associated with an SLA. An SLA is a service level agreement and it's related to an entitlement but an SLA is really just a commitment to respond in a certain way within a certain amount of time. So in this case, I created something called standard SLA. And you can apply these to different entities within CRM. There's lots of different options here, but let's go take a look at the SLA details for this one. So briefly, you can see, you get to decide when this applies. If the case has no entitlement associated with it, we're still going to provide this SLA because we give this SLA just as a result of being a customer. But the product that this case is associated with has to be an active product. So if we no longer support this product, we're not gonna provide an SLA on resolving issues with it. Then we can also define, well, what's the success criteria? Once that first response field is filled in, that's our success criteria. And then we get to decide what defines failure. If it takes more than a day after the case is created to populate that field, that's a failure. What do we do when we have a failure? We reassign the case to the manager of the person who owned the case in this particular situation. Well, what about a warning? Let's warn the user after two hours by sending them an email saying, hey, you've got six hours to fulfill our SLA on this. Please respond or reassign this to somebody who has the bandwidth to handle it. So that's a simple example of an SLA that's been associated with an entitlement template. And going back to the service management area and looking at our actual entitlements, entitlements can be associated with individual account. So let me open up one of the active entitlements we have here. And you can see it looks a lot like the entitlement template. When I create an entitlement, I can use a template to pre-populate these things or I can create it from scratch. That's a quick summary of entitlements and service level agreements or SLAs in Microsoft Dynamics CRM.